welcome to my channel. If you guys like what you see, please click below, clicky clicky, and subscribe. Um, I am doing my second, I believe this is my second Luna for you box. Loving these, I really love these subscription boxes to be honest with you. Um, I just love being able to test out different things, especially if they're not like super duper duper expensive. Um, I just got the Wannable box and I just did a, oh shut up. I was just, I just saw something in there that I was just going to buy today and I forgot to at Ulta. So, um, but this is the Luna for you. I want to say this is $12. I'm not 100% sure. Um, but I will post all my links below, my referral links. So if you guys want to share in the goodies, you can use my link. Um, but this is really funny because <laughs> this is from Wet n Wild and I know that these are probably not, the only thing I don't like about the Luna box is they don't put any prices. So I will have to add the prices for you, the retail values of them. But this is Wet n Wild. This is, um, eyeshadow applicators and they're double sided. And I, I was at Ulta today and I almost picked up, I meant to pick up a set of these sponge applicators because and they're double sided which is super cool because I really like to use them for my um, Maybelline color tattoo eyeshadows because I really like to pack the color in and because they are a cream I don't want to use a brush that just doesn't apply as well I don't like applying um, makeup with my fingers because the, I think the oils get in there and make it crease more so I think these are perfect for applying you know the color tattoo Maybelline color tattoo shadows um, and then you can blend it out with a brush or whatever but I really like to pack it in there first with these so I was at Ulta today and I meant to pick these up and I didn't so now I have them super duper cool let me see so the next thing is a mini lip gloss by Essence and this I will not use um, this is says for charming sparkling lips and it really is a mini I just don't I really the only the thing I'm problem I'm having with the Luna is like I said they don't sh give you the prices but this is a nude lip gloss and I'm just not a nude person whatsoever so I'm I will not use this I'm not even gonna swatch it for you guys because the next thing I got was a wet and wild brow eyeliner pencil in C705 to me this just looks like another black eyeliner and wet and wild is not an expensive brand at all. Um, they're good. I like them. I like Wet n Wild. They've gotten much better. But um, I would not use this on my brows. And I have so many black eyeliners that, you know, I don't know. I'll probably do this in a future giveaway. Um, so, so far, I love one thing. Oh, this is broken. Okay, I'm gonna have to talk to the Luna people. But I got this eyeshadow palette, ombre eyeshadow palette. And I love these two colors um, by Stila in Borealis. But it is broken. So I will open it up and show it to you. Unless this is just a trial palette. But see, look at there, there are two that are supposed to go together as one. But it's in this cheap plastic. I can't get them back together. Oh, Lord. So this looks like it would be a sample of some sort. Oh, my God. It's all over me. Okay. So this is what it looks like with my fingernail mark in it. So obviously I can't give this away to anybody, but it's a it's a nice light blue color and then a purple color, so I will swatch these for you. Very nice, very pigmented, very creamy. Let's see, swatch that. That'd be it for a nice purple smoky eye. It's purple, but it's not like purple. It's purple, but not purple. And then this blue that I dug my nail into trying to get it back into the thing is a really pretty color. I really like this a lot. So let's swatch that. This is very pre pretty. It's like iridescent. You see that? Don't mind this other swatch right here. But, so it's very nice. So, I mean, you could do a nice smoky eye with this, you know, these two colors. So I will give this a shot. Um, you know, the packaging, super duper chintzy, like, not happy at all. 
that it came separated, that it's, Whatever. I'm going to put it, just put it back in the box. And so, you know, when I decide to use it, I don't know. I may contact them because I just don't think that's right. I think that's kind of ridiculous. Uh, Steel is a very nice brand, but you know, that's just looks like Okay, and then I got also from Wet n Wild. So this is a lot of stuff from Wet n Wild. Um, this princess bronzer, and I have a million bronzers, but and this is not a matte bronzer where I could do contouring with. It might be a little too dark for my skin, but I really like the brush. The brush. I'm not going to open it, but the brush is shaped kind of like a crescent moon shape. I don't know if you guys can catch it or not. I don't think you can. But it's really cool. It's a really cool shaped brush. It's a very pretty palette. I really, you know, like it. But I don't know. It may be too dark for me. So um, that may go in a giveaway also. And then the last thing is from Pop Beauty. And Pop Beauty, you know, I always thought Pop Beauty was not expensive. It is pretty expensive. Um, I was looking at some of their inliners and stuff like that, and they were like 16 bucks. This is a mini one, and this is an alluring amethyst. And I love the fact that it's purple. So I will swatch that for you. Yeah, okay. I normally love Pop stuff. I was looking at some of their um, cream it tugs and it's not very um, it's a beautiful color if you can see it here can you see like the shimmer in it when you put it on your it, it's very dark and it's just I don't know it's just not very smooth and creamy like it's it's you know I, I don't know not loving it um, my Luna for you not loving I mean I think the most exciting thing that I have here is or these applicators just because I needed them today. But everything is pretty cheap besides the Stila. Stila is not very cheap, but everything else is cheap stuff. Um, not to say it's bad, but is it worth, what is the Luna, $12? I don't really know. Um, and because there's so many, I won't use this. Um, this, I'm pretty upset that, you know, the one product that is kind of high-end um, is just not staying in the case so you know very very cheap cheap you know packaging um wet and wild another black eyeliner like you know I, I just no thank you um this amethyst one I was really excited about but I don't like how it goes on it's kind of a purple with a gold so I really do, I don't know if you're going to be able to pick that up. I really do love the color. 